comedian David Boyle and I'm quitting alcohol. So there's obviously some new people here today. Some New Year's resolution people. I'm going to quit alcohol. New Year, new me. So they've gone to Spotify. They've typed in quitting alcohol and this podcast has popped up. And I'm just going to tell you straight up, I can't help you, cunt. If you've come here for help and you think I'm going to help you quit alcohol, you've come to the wrong fucking place. I can't help you. The only person that can help you is you and there's fuck all chance you're going to do that. No, this is not the fucking positive start to 2023 that I wanted to make. But it's the truth. I can't help you. I wish I could, but this podcast has probably helped about four people quit drinking for about two weeks in total. All up, this podcast probably has about two weeks of total abstinence to its name. If I could help you, I would, but the fact of the matter is, I've learned over the last almost four years that no one can fucking help anyone. You've got to help yourself. That's it. The best this podcast can offer you, the best I can offer you is a feeling that you're not alone, that you're not in this by yourself and you're not alone. There's me and I'm pretty sure if you're here, we've followed a somewhat similar path and other than me, there's thousands of people listening that I know are also like me. So that's about it. That is a nice thing, isn't it? To know you're not alone at least. That's nice, but fucking, can I help you? I don't even know if I can point you in the right direction. The only fucking direction I can really give you is go back to the start of this podcast, go back to day one, start listening from there and hear what a miserable cunt I was for maybe like the first 300 days And then come back to the present day. Well, not this episode. I don't sound very fucking upbeat in this episode. I mean, go like a couple of episodes back, like maybe like December 30. Not today. Don't compare day one to today because that might sound pretty similar. But if you go back to day one and listen, you can see the path that I've taken. You can see what it looks like or listen to what it looks like. Does that even make sense? But you can listen in and see what it's like to have quit alcohol for good every single day. You can listen to every single fucking day of someone who's quit alcohol. That's something, isn't it? And quickly it will become clear that it's not a linear path. There's progression, there's regression, it's all over the fucking shop. Like, I don't even think there's value in giving advice. (laughs) I'm not even too sure it fucking gets through. Because everyone knows what they should do. Like, I need to stop drinking because it makes me feel like shit and it's ruining my life. Oh, well, I've figured that out. I'll stop drinking then. Problem solved. Next. What's the next problem? I am fucking dominating these problems. That's pretty much the only advice. In essence, if you fucking boil it down, it's just like, yeah, stop drinking. I mean, that's all you have to do, really. That's it. That's all you need to do, but that's just the start. (laughs) That's the fucking start of the problems. But I'll tell you this. I'll give you some fucking hope. When you do quit alcohol and you make the decision to quit alcohol for good, your life gets better, infinitely better. You have to work at it constantly though. It's not just fucking I quit alcohol and then my life automatically gets better. No, it's like the work starts when you quit alcohol. But all those things that you think alcohol is preventing you from doing, it is actually preventing you from doing all those things. I'm proof of that and I'm a lazy fucking unintelligent piece of shit and I've been able to do some amazing things that were never going to be possible while I was drinking over the last almost four years. So if you got the balls or the flange to do it, everything does get fucking better but it's hard work and I can't help you. No one can help you. 
You can look for guidance and get a little bit of direction if you're willing to fucking listen. But the only person that can fucking help you is you. Now fucking, it's Sunday. You're hungover as shit. Eat some fatty fucking shit food. Watch some shit TV. And get into the year tomorrow. Don't make any big moves today. Anyway, welcome to the podcast. (laughs) Welcome. That'll fucking do for today. And I'll see you the fuck later.